Hi guys, IRL Algo here. I want to walk through how I personally add funds to my Algorand wallet. There are a ton of different ways to add Algorand to your Algorand wallet. There's Qcoin, there's Kraken, go through Ledger. A lot of the options are outlined pretty simply with their respective links on how to algo nft.com. Again, it's a great resource that was made by a fellow Algo fan, Meyer Algo. I'm a big fan. It's, just, it's a great resource. It's concise. It's updated often. There are other ones out there that are also really great. KK Honey is an Algo fan who made a fantastic How to Algo NFT website that is stellar reading. Market Maker is another one that has great YouTube videos. There's a lot of how-tos with screens on there. I know that sometimes getting started is the hardest. So I want to walk you through how I add funds to my Algorand wallet. What I normally do is I go to Coinbase on my phone and it'll pull up your kind of your dashboard or your home. You're going to click the blue button at the bottom that has arrows on it. It's right in the center there. Click on that blue button and then it gives you some options as far as what you'd like to do. I select the top one. I want to buy crypto with cash. It will give you a list. I always skip skimming through the list and instead I opt to just, I always type just algo at the top. It will bring up um, Algorand. It'll show you the logo. You'll know that you have the right thing and that you, you found what you're looking for. So I click algo. I'll show you my screen here. I personally like to use PayPal. I linked it together. I already had a PayPal account. It was really easy to do when I signed up for Coinbase. So that's still how I go about it. I had set up an ACH a while back for it and I ended up like holding my funds for longer. So I have found that when I go through my PayPal and buy Algo, my funds are released immediately and I can move them straight into my Algorand wallet. So I'm going to enter the amount of Algo I want to buy. It'll be in USD in my case. So I'm going to hit the button at the bottom that says preview buy. It's going to give me the summary, what I'm paying in a fee, and at the bottom there'll be a buy now option. So I'm gonna click on that. So it'll say pending for a second, and then sometimes if it's fast, you'll see it right away. If not, it'll show in a couple seconds. It'll say successfully processed. So I'm gonna click done. And then it'll bring you back to your home screen if you're doing it the same way I am. Okay, so I bought Algo off Coinbase through PayPal. Now I want to move it into my ParaWallet. So I'm going to jump out of Coinbase and into the ParaWallet. And then at the bottom of the ParaWallet, there's kind of the same button with arrows on it going either way, but it's yellow. And you're going to click that bottom button. And then it gives you three choices. In this case, I want to receive Algo. So I'm going to click the bottom middle one that says receive. I'm going to select my wallet chuck that we made and then it'll give you this. I click copy. So then I jump back to my Coinbase account and I hit that blue button again. And instead of clicking the top buy crypto with cash like I did before, I'm going to click the fourth one down. It says send crypto to another wallet. So I'm going to click send crypto to another wallet. It will bring up a page that looks like this. And if you don't see Algorand in that little square, you can actually click on it and it will show you some other cryptos if you have any in your wallet. I did some learn to earn on Coinbase that is just kind of hanging out there. So we want to make sure it says Algo and then there's a little button at the top there that says Max. So we're going to click Max and move all the Algo we just bought over to our Apparel wallet. Then this is where copying that wallet address comes in handy. It'll ask you where you want to send it at the very top. You're going to click that and then paste that wallet information and click preview. It'll give you a summary. So I'm going to click send now. I have it set up for a two-step verification, which is one of the reasons why I still use my phone when I buy Algo. I click from messages for that code that it sent me for verification and then the blue button to continue. And then you'll get a message when it's successful and it'll say successfully sent. I like to immediately jump into Para, make sure that that transaction went through like it should. 
So now we have Algo, we can opt into assets. We can get started doing all sorts of fun things in the Algorand ecosystem, NFTs, DeFi, gaming.